We placed a large operator in every cab to show you just how different these loaders are when it comes to cab comfort. Here is the Bobcat loader. We have exceptional front to back and side to side foot room and the joysticks are set wider than the others to provide ample side to side leg room. They're also adjustable to the front and back and move with the seat. This can help ease operator fatigue throughout a long workday. Air vents are mounted high and low throughout the cab to keep your entire body cool or warm. And the high air vents will also help keep your windows defrosted when it is cold outside. Let's take a look at the Kubota loader. The operator has good side to side foot room, but there is little to no room front to back. The side to side leg room is okay, but the joysticks are not adjustable and this operator's legs begin to rub against them. This also limits the ability to use all of the side to side foot room that's available. The joysticks also do not move with the seat, so operator comfort could be compromised by the end of the day. Their heating and cooling system only has vents along the left side of the cab. And the slide up door prevents them from putting any vent up top. And their wiper fluid container is in an odd location. It's almost like they forgot to design it into the machine. One other thing, while their door opening is wide, if you're tall, Getting in can be difficult because you have to duck below the sliding door. Plus, the door's track limits what they can mount on the column. Next up is the Caterpillar loader. I hope it does better than Kubota. The amount of foot room is not great. In fact, it's the tightest of the group. The side to side leg room is also tight. So overall, it has limited foot room. However, the joysticks are adjustable and move with the seat. The air vents are all positioned down low so they won't do a good job getting cool or warm air to your upper body. One last note, the door barely makes it halfway open so it's not very convenient getting in and out of this machine. Here's the case and New Holland. The side to side legroom isn't bad but that's where the good news ends. The amount of foot room is not great there is little room front to back. The joysticks are adjustable to the front and back, but unfortunately, they don't move with the seat. The adjustment is also clumsy, poorly planned, and not very finished. Although they have several heating and cooling vents, they're all down low, so the air movement will do little to cool or warm your upper body. Vents that are this low will do a poor job of keeping your windows defrosted when it's cold out. And like the Caterpillar, their door does not open the whole way, so getting in and out becomes a challenge. For nearly 60 years, Bobcat has been building the best loader in the compact equipment industry. And we know just how important a comfortable cab is. Other machines are good at a few of these comfort features, but only the Bobcat loader has them all. Get the best designed cab on the market. It's a Bobcat advantage.